Hi guys, today we're gonna to talk about how to do a sigil. This is an important step in manifesting what you want um, in witchcraft and in your spell work. So we're gonna start by creating um, your sigil by, by writing out a sentence. What is it that you want? First, you have to decide what you're looking for. For this example today, we're gonna to use money. So I'm gonna start by writing out, I want money. So this is the beginning. Now the problem with this is that we have to put it into present tense instead of past tense. So I'm going to change that to I have money. Now that I've got it in the present tense, that's the next step. Um, the following step after that is to shut down that sentence into smaller letters. So a lot of people will um, cross out the vowels if I do that, I've got I, or I can keep I, um, then I've got H, M, N, Y. Okay, so um, with those, I've got I, H, M, Y. Um, we could create a sigil using those letters if we choose, or we can get rid of the I and just do H, M, Y. So a lot of people will create their own sigil by scribbling around different symbols. Where do you get these symbols? Some people just start by creating with letters. So I'm gonna draw an H, just a funny H, and then I'm gonna draw an M, and I'm gonna put an M maybe sideways, so I've got an H and an M, and then I'm gonna add a Y. So I'm gonna add a Y right there. Now that may not look like much, but I just created a symbol, um, a sigil. So with this sigil, what I'll do is to activate the sigil, I'll say a prayer, I'll do a blessing, um, I'll put my intention into it. A lot of times I'll just close my eyes, put my hands around it, and use my energy to make it real. Now um, there's two things you can do next, you can, uh, hang it up if you choose um, and put it on like your work wall, uh, maybe on your fridge or your mirror, um, or the opposite, you can actually just um, bless it and then throw it away. Sometimes out of sight, out of mind works as well. Well, this was just an easy step today on creating a sigil. I hope it helps and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks, bye.